Ginkgo biloba, Wikipedia audio. Ginkgo biloba, commonly known as ginkgo or ginkgo, also known as the ginkgo tree or the maidenhair tree, is the only living species in the division Ginkgophyta, all others being extinct. It is found in fossils dating back 270 million years. Native to China, the tree is widely cultivated, and was cultivated early in human history. It has various uses in traditional medicine and as a source of food. The genus name Ginkgo is regarded as a misspelling of the Japanese Jinkyo, silver apricot. The species was initially described by Carl Linnaeus in 1771, the specific epithet biloba derived from the Latin bis, two and loba, lobed, referring to the shape of the leaves. Two names for the species recognize the botanist Richard Salisbury, a placement by Nelson as Terraphyllus salisbariensis and the earlier Salisbaria adiantifolia proposed by James Edward Smith. The epithet of the latter may have been intended to denote a characteristic resembling adiantum, the genus of maidenhair ferns. The relationship of ginkgo to other plant groups remains uncertain. It has been placed loosely in the divisions Spermatophyta and Penophyta, but no consensus has been reached. Since its seeds are not protected by an ovary wall, it can morphologically be considered a gymnosperm. The apricot-like structures produced by female ginkgo trees are technically not fruits, but are seeds that have a shell consisting of a soft and fleshy section, and a hard section. The sarcotesta has a strong smell that most people find unpleasant. Taxonomy and Naming The ginkgo is classified in its own division, the ginkophyta, comprising the single class Ginkupsida, order Ginkgols, family Ginkgoaceae, genus Ginkgo, and is the only extant species within this group. It is one of the best known examples of a living fossil, because Ginkgols other than G. biloba are not known from the fossil record after the Pliocene. Chinese scientists published a draft genome of ginkgo biloba in 2016. The tree has an exceptionally large genome of 10.6 billion DNA nucleobase letters and about 41,840 predicted genes which enable a considerable number of antibacterial and chemical defense mechanisms. Despite its complicated spelling, which is due to an exceptionally complicated etymology including a transcription error, ginkgo is usually pronounced slash ko slash, which has given rise to the common other spelling ginkgo. The spelling pronunciation slash ko slash is also documented in some dictionaries. The older Chinese name for this plant is, meaning silver fruit, pronounced ingu in Mandarin or Nanguo in Cantonese. The most usual names today are, meaning white fruit, and, meaning silver apricot. The former name was borrowed directly in Vietnamese as BCHQU. The latter name was borrowed in Japanese and Korean, when the tree itself was introduced from China. The scientific name Ginkgo is the result of a spelling error that occurred three centuries ago. Kanji typically have multiple pronunciations in Japanese, and the characters used for Jinan can also be pronounced Ginki. Engelbert Kaempfer, the first Westerner to investigate the species in 1690, wrote down this pronunciation in the notes that he later used for the Amoanitates exodicy with the awkward spelling ginkgo. This appears to be a simple error of Kaempfer, taking his spelling of other Japanese words containing the syllable ky into account, a more precise romanization following his writing habits would have been ginkgo or ginkgo. Lin, who relied on Kaempfer when dealing with Japanese plants, adopted the spelling given in Kaempfer's Flora Japonica.
Although extracts of ginkgo biloba leaf sold as dietary supplements may be marketed to improve cognitive function, there is no scientific evidence for effects on memory or attention in healthy people. Ginkgo extract has also been studied as a possible treatment for cognitive impairment in Alzheimer's disease, but there is no good evidence for it having any effect. Systematic reviews of clinical trial results have shown there is no scientific evidence for effectiveness of ginkgo in treating high blood pressure, menopause-related cognitive decline, tinnitus, post-stroke recovery, peripheral arterial disease, macular degeneration, or altitude sickness. The nut-like gametophytes inside the seeds are particularly esteemed in Asia and are a traditional Chinese food. Ginkgo nuts are used in kanji, and are often served at special occasions such as weddings and the Chinese New Year. In Chinese culture, they are believed to have health benefits, some also consider them to have aphrodisiac qualities. Japanese cooks add ginkgo seeds to dishes such as shawin mushi, and cooked seeds are often eaten along with other dishes. When eaten in large quantities or over a long period, the gametophyte of the seed can cause poisoning by 4-O-methylpyridoxine. MPN is heat-stable and not destroyed by cooking. Studies have demonstrated the convulsions caused by MPN can be prevented or treated successfully with pyridoxine. Etymology and Pronunciation some people are sensitive to the chemicals in the sarcotesta, the outer fleshy coating. These people should handle the seeds with care when preparing the seeds for consumption, wearing disposable gloves. The symptoms are allergic contact dermatitis or blisters similar to that caused by contact with poison ivy. However, seeds with the fleshy coating removed are mostly safe to handle. Ginkgo may have undesirable effects, especially for individuals with blood circulation disorders and those taking anticoagulants such as aspirin or warfarin, although studies have found ginkgo has little or no effect on the anticoagulant properties or pharmacodynamics of warfarin in healthy subjects. Additional side effects include increased risk of bleeding, gastrointestinal discomfort, nausea, vomiting, diarrhea, headaches, dizziness, heart palpitations, and restlessness. Ginkgo should be used with caution when combined with other herbs known to increase bleeding. According to a systemic review, the effects of ginkgo on pregnant women may include increased bleeding time, and it should be avoided during lactation because of inadequate safety evidence. Some authors claim that ginkgo biloba extracts, which are CO-administered with anticoagulant drugs such as warfarin, increase the risk for bleeding because of their assumed antiplatelet activity. Concerns that standardized ginkgo biloba preparations significantly impact hemostasis or adversely affect the safety of anticoagulant drugs are however not supported by current medical literature. The presence of a mentoflavone in G. biloba leaves would indicate a potential for interactions with many medications through the strong inhibition of CYP3A4 and CYP2C9, however, no empirical evidence supports this. Further, at recommended doses, studies have shown, multiple dose administration of ginkgo biloba did not affect cytochrome p452 d6 or 3a4 activity in normal volunteers the concentration of a mentoflavone found even in commercial ginkgo extracts possibly is too low to be pharmacologically active ginkgo biloba leaves and sarcotesta also contain ginkgolic acids which are highly allergenic 
long-chain alkyl phenols such as bilabol or adipostatin A individuals with a history of strong allergic reactions to poison ivy, mangoes, cashews, and other alkyl phenol-producing plants are more likely to experience allergic reaction when consuming non-standardized ginkgo-containing preparations, combinations, or extracts thereof. The level of these allergens in standardized pharmaceutical preparations from ginkgo biloba was restricted to 5 ppm by the Commission E of the former Federal German Health Authority. Dietary Supplement Cooking Ginkgo has long been cultivated in China. Some planted trees at temples are believed to be over 1,500 years old. The first record of Europeans encountering it is in 1690, in Japanese temple gardens where the tree was seen by the German botanist Engelbert Kaempfer. Because of its status in Buddhism and Confucianism, the ginkgo is also widely planted in Korea and parts of Japan. In both areas, some naturalization has occurred, with ginkgos seeding into natural forests. Side Effects Allergic precautions and contraindications Cultivation Paleontology Rise and decline In some areas, most intentionally planted ginkgos are male cultivars grafted onto plants propagated from seed, because the male trees will not produce the malodorous seeds. The popular cultivar Autumn Gold is a clone of a male plant. The disadvantage of male ginkgo biloba trees is that they are highly allergenic. They have an opal's allergy scale rating of 7, whereas female trees, which can produce no pollen, have an opal's allergy scale rating of 2. Female cultivars include Liberty Splendor, Santa Cruz, and Golden Girl the latter so named because of the striking yellow color of its leaves in the fall. Many cultivars are listed in the literature in the UK, of which the Compact Troll has gained the Royal Horticultural Society's Award of Garden Merit. Limited Number of Species Ginkgos adapt well to the urban environment, tolerating pollution, and confined soil spaces. They rarely suffer disease problems, even in urban conditions, and are attacked by few insects. For this reason, and for their general beauty, ginkgos are excellent urban and shade trees, and are widely planted along many streets. Ginkgos are also popular subjects for growing as penjing and bonsai, they can be kept artificially small and tended over centuries. Furthermore, the trees are easy to propagate from seed. The ginkgo leaf is the symbol of the Urizenk school of Japanese tea ceremony. The tree is the official tree of the Japanese capital of Tokyo, and the symbol of Tokyo is a ginkgo leaf. The ginkgo is a living fossil, with fossils recognizably related to modern ginkgo from the Permian, dating back 270 million years. The most plausible ancestral group for the order Ginkgols is the Teridospermatophyta, also known as the seed ferns, specifically the order Peltispermales. The closest living relatives of the clade are the cycads, 84 which share with the extant G. biloba the characteristic of modal sperm. Fossil plants with leaves that have more than four veins per segment have customarily been assigned to the taxon ginkgo, while the taxon bira is used to classify those with fewer than four veins per segment. Sphenobeira has been used for plants with a broadly wedge-shaped leaf that lacks a distinct leaf stem. Fossils attributable to the genus ginkgo first appeared in the early Jurassic. One of the earliest fossils ascribed to the Ginkophyta is Trichopides, distinguished by having multiple forked leaves with cylindrical, thread-like ultimate divisions. The genus Ginkgo diversified and spread throughout Laurasia during the Middle Jurassic and Early Cretaceous. 
The Ginkka Phyta declined in diversity as the Cretaceous progressed, and by the Paleocene, Ginkgo adiantoides was the only ginkgo species left in the Northern Hemisphere, while a markedly different form persisted in the Southern Hemisphere. Along with that of ferns, cycads, and cycadioids, the species diversity in the genus ginkgo drops through the Cretaceous, at the same time the flowering plants were on the rise, this is supports the hypothesis that over time, flowering plants with better adaptations to disturbance displaced ginkgo and its associates. 93. Adaption to a single environment At the end of the Pliocene, ginkgo fossils disappeared from the fossil record everywhere except in a small area of central China where the modern species survived. It is doubtful whether the northern hemisphere fossil species of ginkgo can be reliably distinguished. Given the slow pace of evolution and morphological similarity between members of the genus, there may have been only one or two species existing in the northern hemisphere through the entirety of the Cenozoic present-day G. biloba and G. gardneri from the Paleocene of Scotland, 85. Description At least morphologically, G. gardneri and the Southern Hemisphere species are the only known post-Jurassic taxa that can be unequivocally recognized. The remainder may have been ecotypes or subspecies. The implications would be that G. biloba had occurred over an extremely wide range, had remarkable genetic flexibility and, though evolving genetically, never showed much speciation. While it may seem improbable that a single species may exist as a contiguous entity for many millions of years, many of the ginkgo's life history parameters fit, extreme longevity, slow reproduction rate, a wide, apparently contiguous, but steadily contracting distribution, and extreme ecological conservatism. 91. Phytochemicals Branches Leaves Given the slow rate of evolution of the genus, ginkgo possibly represents a pre-angiosperm strategy for survival in disturbed streamside environments. Ginkgo evolved in an era before flowering plants, when ferns, cycads, and cycadioids dominated disturbed streamside environments, forming low, open, shrubby canopies. Ginkgo's large seeds and habit of bolting growing to a height of 10 meters before elongating its side branches may be adaptions to such an environment. Modern-day G. biloba grows best in environments that are well watered and drained, 87 and the extremely similar fossil ginkgo favored similar environments, the sediment record at the majority of fossil ginkgo localities indicates it grew primarily in disturbed environments, along streams and levees. Ginkgo, therefore, presents an ecological paradox because while it possesses some favorable traits for living in disturbed environments many of its other life history traits are the opposite of those exhibited by modern plants that thrive in disturbed settings. 92. Ginkgos are large trees, normally reaching a height of 20-35 m, with some specimens in China being over 50 m. The tree has an angular crown and long, somewhat erratic branches, and is usually deep-rooted and resistant to wind and snow damage. Young trees are often tall and slender, and sparsely branched, the crown becomes broader as the tree ages. During autumn, the leaves turn a bright yellow, then fall, sometimes within a short space of time. A combination of resistance to disease, insect-resistant wood, and the ability to form aerial roots and sprouts makes ginkgos long-lived, with some specimens claimed to be more than 2,500 years old. Ginkgo is a relatively shade-intolerant species that grows best in environments that are well-watered and well-drained. The species shows a preference for disturbed sites, 
in the semi-wild stands at Tian Mu Shan, many specimens are found along stream banks, rocky slopes, and cliff edges. Accordingly, ginkgo retains a prodigious capacity for vegetative growth. It is capable of sprouting from embedded buds near the base of the trunk in response to disturbances, such as soil erosion. Old individuals are also capable of producing aerial roots on the undersides of large branches in response to disturbances such as crown damage. These roots can lead to successful clonal reproduction upon contacting the soil. These strategies are evidently important in the persistence of ginkgo. In a survey of the semi wild stands remaining in Tian Mushan, 40% of the specimens surveyed were multi stemmed and few saplings were present, 8687. Extracts of ginkgo leaves contain phenolic acids, pronthocyanidins, flavonoid glycosides, such as myracetin, comphorol, isoramnidin, and quercetin, and the terpene trilactins, ginkolides, and bilobolides. The leaves also contain unique ginkgo biflavones, as well as alkyl phenols and polyprenols. Ginkgo branches grow in length by growth of shoots with regularly spaced leaves, as seen on most trees. From the axils of these leaves, spur shoots develop on second year growth. Short shoots have very short internodes and their leaves are usually unlobed. They are short and knobby and are arranged regularly on the branches except on first-year growth. Because of the short internodes, leaves appear to be clustered at the tips of short shoots, and reproductive structures are formed only on them. In ginkgos, as in other plants that possess them, short shoots allow the formation of new leaves in the older parts of the crown. After a number of years, a short shoot may change into a long shoot, or vice versa. The leaves are unique among seed plants, being fan-shaped with veins radiating out into the leaf blade, sometimes bifurcating, but never anastomosing to form a network. Two veins enter the leaf blade at the base and fork repeatedly in two, this is known as dichotomous venation. The leaves are usually 5-10 cm, but sometimes up to 15 cm long. The old popular name maidenhair tree is because the leaves resemble some of the pinny of the maidenhair fern, Adiantum capillus veneris. Ginkgos are prized for their autumn foliage, which is a deep saffron yellow. Leaves of long shoots are usually notched or lobed, but only from the outer surface between the veins. They are born both on the more rapidly growing branch tips, where they are alternate and spaced out, and also on the short, stubby spur shoots, where they are clustered at the tips. Leaves are green both on the top and bottom and have stomata on both sides. Ginkgos are dioecious, with separate sexes, some trees being female and others being male. Male plants produce small pollen cones with sporophylls, each bearing two microsporangia spirally arranged around a central axis. Female plants do not produce cones. Two ovules are formed at the end of a stalk, and after pollination, one or both develop into seeds. The seed is 1.52 cm long. Its fleshy outer layer is light yellow-brown, soft, and fruit-like. It is attractive in appearance, but contains butyric acid and smells like rancid butter or vomit when fallen. Beneath the sarcotesta is the hard sclerotesta and a papery endotesta, with the nucella surrounding the female gametophyte at the center. The fertilization of ginkgo seeds occurs via modal sperm as in cycads, ferns, mosses, and algae. The sperm are large and are similar to the sperm of cycads, which are slightly larger. 
Ginkgo sperm were first discovered by the Japanese botanist Sakuguro Hirase in 1896. The sperm have a complex multi-layered structure, which is a continuous belt of basal bodies that form the base of several thousand flagella which actually have a cilia-like motion. The flagella slash cilia apparatus pulls the body of the sperm forwards. The sperm have only a tiny distance to travel to the archegonia, of which there are usually two or three. Two sperm are produced, one of which successfully fertilizes the ovule. Although it is widely held that fertilization of ginkgo seeds occurs just before or after they fall in early autumn, Embryos ordinarily occur in seeds just before and after they drop from the tree. Trunk Bark Ginkgo Pollen Bearing Cones Bud in Spring Ovules Ready for Fertilization Female Gametophyte, dissected from a seed freshly shed from the tree, containing a well-developed embryo. Immature ginkgo ovules and leaves Autumn leaves and fallen seeds A forest of saplings sprout among last year's seeds Ginkgo tree in autumn Fruit on tree Although ginkgo biloba and other species of the genus were once widespread throughout the world, its range shrank until by two million years ago it was restricted to a small area of China. For centuries, it was thought to be extinct in the wild, but is now known to grow in at least two small areas in Zhejiang province in eastern China, in the Tian Mushan Reserve. However, recent studies indicate high genetic uniformity among ginkgo trees from these areas, arguing against a natural origin of these populations and suggesting the ginkgo trees in these areas may have been planted and preserved by Chinese monks over a period of about 1,000 years. This study demonstrates a greater genetic diversity in southwestern China populations, supporting glacial refugia in mountains surrounding eastern Tibetan Plateau where several old-growth candidates for wild populations have been reported. Whether native ginkgo populations still exist has not been demonstrated unequivocally, but evidence grows favoring these southwestern populations as wild, from genetic data but also from history of those territories, with bigger ginkgo biloba trees being older than surrounding human settlements. Where it occurs in the wild, it is found infrequently in deciduous forests and valleys on acidic loess with good drainage. The soil it inhabits is typically in the pH range of 5.0 to 5.5. In many areas of China, it has been long cultivated, and it is common in the southern third of the country. It has also been commonly cultivated in North America for over 200 years and in Europe for close to 300, but during that time, it has never become significantly naturalized. Ginkgo umaensis Ginkgo apods Ginkgo adiantoides or a new taxon from the USA, G. cranii Extant ginkgo biloba the first use as a medicine is recorded in the late 15th century in China, among Western countries, its first registered medicinal use was in Germany in 1965. Despite use, controlled studies do not support the extract's efficacy for most of the indicated conditions. Extreme examples of the ginkgo's tenacity may be seen in Hiroshima, Japan where six trees growing between 1-2 km from the 1945 atom bomb explosion were among the few living things in the area to survive the blast. Although almost all other plants in the area were killed, the ginkgos, though charred, survived and were soon healthy again, among other hibakujimoku. The six trees are still alive, they are marked with signs at Hausenbo Temple, Shukiyan, JCIG, 
at the former site of Senda Elementary School near Mayukibashi, at the Majin Temple, and an Edo period cutting at Anrakuji Temple. The ginkgo tree that had stood next to Tsurajayaka Hachimanji's stone stairway approximately from the Shinto Shrine's foundation in 1063, and which appears in almost every old depiction of the shrine, was completely uprooted and irreparably damaged in March 2010. According to an expert who analyzed the tree, the fall was likely due to rot. Later, both the stump of the severed tree and a replanted section of the trunk sprouted leaves. The shrine is in the city of Kamakura, Kanagawa Prefecture, Japan. The tree was nicknamed Kakurich, deriving from an Edo period urban legend which told of a suspected assassin hiding behind it before striking his victim. Reproduction Distribution and Habitat History Hiroshima 1,000-year-old ginkgo at Tsurajayaka Hakimang Bibliography